out the pango slide across the suspension bridge. You and your men head him off. We'll take care of the ammunition train. <laughs> comes the munition train. I'll use the fort's order first. If there's any difficulty, you know what to do. I wonder what happened to that military escort that was supposed to meet us here. Lieutenant Gomez? Yes? I have an order from the council at San Mendolito to take over these munitions. Understand this. I was expecting a military escort, but uh... I can't help that. You have your orders. I have my orders to deliver these munitions to the military of San Mendolito and to no one else. Then you refuse the council's order? I do. murders didn't spare anyone. You can still catch up with the train. Those wagons leave a pretty good trail. and turn them loose. 
Keep out of sight and meet us later. The other wagons are empty, too. Yes, Don DeLoro must have planned all this to get arms for the Yakis. The Yakis? That would be serious. It would be a disaster. It might start an Indian revolt that would threaten the whole republic. Moira's army is in no condition to control a rebellion now. Those munitions can't be very far away. Couldn't we spread out and search for them? No, searching every cave and ravine would take days. We'll have to force them out into the open. Now, when the patrol finds the murdered men in the crossroads, They'll immediately report to the council. And when they do, I have a plan. When the troops got there, the munition wagons were gone. And all the men were dead. They found this paper near the body of the lieutenant. Why, this is a forgery. The council never issued any such order. of San Mandelito. I know where the stolen munitions are hidden. They will be brought to San Mandelito within 24 hours, signed Zorro. Just an idle boast. Well, it's very possible that the Legion stole the munitions themselves and are returning them to gain favor with the Council. Well, in that case, why not use the militia to capture Zorro and his Legion when they bring the munitions into town? An excellent idea. I'll post lookouts immediately at all roads leading to the city. Keep the entire militia on call for emergency duty. Unless I'm mistaken, Don DeLauro will be moving those munitions very soon. Assemble the Legion. Right. He can't know where those munitions are hidden. Perhaps. But we can't take any chances. Those arms are too important. You are right. Once those weapons are in the hands of the Yaquis, we can wipe out this meddling Zorro and his Legion. And that's only the starting point. With our Yaquis armed, we can capture more munitions, equip more Indians, and in that way have an irresistible army to crown Don DeLauro Emperor of Mexico. Those are pleasant dreams, gentlemen. But they cannot be assured until we have actually distributed the guns to the Yaquis. That's easy. We can move the munitions to the ceremonial cave. Don DeLauro will give his orders at once. San Mandalito have taken the land that is rightfully yours. And now they seek to destroy you with their guns and powder. But Don DeLauro watches over his unfortunate people. The guns and powder have been captured and hidden from your enemies. You must help bring them back here. Tarmac will lead you. Each of these pigeons is marked. You take Silver Rock, you cover Barajos Pass, and you, Aliso Gorge. Now keep a sharp lookout. We'll wait here for your message. That's the last of the powder. We're all set to go. 
Heading for Barajos Pass. Ramon, you take the men and go to. I'll try and head it off. 